Capricorn, I hope you are doing fantastic. Welcome to the channel. Thank you to everybody who has liked, shared, commented and subscribed to the channel so far. I very much appreciate you. We are in a different setting. You are chilling out with me on my reset day, which is Sunday. Let's get into it. We are going to be checking out who is coming in for you, Capricorn, and what do they want? Okay, we're going to be getting straight into it. I do have two decks here. We're going to be drawing for the message from these cards and we're going to be clarifying with the Astro Matrix, Matrix Tarot. Thank you to everybody who has liked, shared, commented and subscribed to the channel so far. I very much appreciate you. Messages for Capricorn. Tell me about Capricorn. Who is coming in for Capricorn, please, Spirit? Spirit, please guide and protect me as I channel the messages that Capricorn needs to know at this time. Tell me about Capricorn, please. Messages for the sign of Capricorn. Five of Cups wanted to pop out. For some of you, this person is in regret, whoever this is. Tell me about Capricorn. Messages for Capricorn, please, Spirit. There's too many cards. Tell me about Capricorn. We have the hanged one in the reverse. Could be a Pisces. Page of Pentacles. Earth sign energy. Who's coming in for Capricorn, please? Eight of Wands in the reverse. This could be somebody who you cut communication with. I feel like you were stuck on this person for quite a long time. But something wasn't moving forward in the past. This could have been somebody who you wanted a new opportunity with. You could have reached out to this person and you could have been ignored or something. Something was stuck here. Something didn't move forward. You were stuck on this person. You were caught up on this person, whoever this is. Capricorn. The Eight of Pentacles. This is somebody who could have chosen work over love. This could be somebody who is very much consumed with making some sort of goal happen for themselves or was in the past. This could have been a reason as to why something didn't move forward. But you were caught up on this person is who this is. Two of Wands. Page of Wands. You really wanted a new beginning with this person in the past. You did. And I feel like maybe somebody went in another direction here. The Magician card. Somebody's focus was elsewhere in the past. Four of Swords in the reverse. Queen of Wands. Four of Wands. Bottom of the deck we've got the Queen of Swords. be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius here. Nine of Swords. Okay. Somebody's somebody's worried here. Could be a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius. Somebody's worried here. Three of Swords. This definitely could be somebody who's in another connection at this time, or they went towards another connection. We'll clarify. This is someone who you had to set some sort of boundary with. I feel like in the past, Capricorn, you were very open to this person. This is somebody who you were stuck on. This is somebody who you wanted some sort of new start with, okay? There was something about you reaching out to this person. This is somebody who you was trying to kind of coerce to come out of some sort of seclusion or reserved energy from you. This is a person who withdrew from you. This is a person who maybe you felt a little bit um, stuck in terms of you didn't know whether you was coming or going with another person here. This is somebody who you wanted a definite new beginning with and this person could have cut communication. This person could have went in another direction because with, with the two of wands and the queen of wands, I do feel like there was another person here. This could be a fire sign, an Aries, a Leo or a Sagittarius. Some of you could be dealing with an earth sign as well. 
something didn't move forward and i feel like the blockage here was another person somebody was in the middle there was a free piece there was someone else there was another option here and i feel like with the four of wands coming out somebody could have been committed whether they told you this or not this is a person who had a stable situation um elsewhere this is somebody who withdrew from you held back from you and was in another situation i feel like this person's worried now because you've changed on this this person here with the capricorn you could have switched up on this person but i do feel like heavily it's because this person switched up on you there's something about this person switching up on you and with the nine of swords this person is worried about something here this is definitely somebody who you wanted a union with and this person could have cut you off with the three of swords and the king of swords this person broke your heart okay you was hoping to have something flourish you was hoping for a new beginning with this person yeah and this person cut you off this person broke your heart this person hurt you this is a person who hurt you i feel like you were trying to trying to remain hopeful capricorn for some sort of new beginning new start it was a, a very much an urge for you to have a new beginning with somebody or someone had wanted an urge, had an urge to have a new beginning somewhere nine of wands in the reverse you ran yourself ragged trying to figure out this person this was a conundrum to you this this was a conundrum you were stuck you was you had no closure this is somebody who didn't give you any top sort of closure this is who i'm picking up on the empress could be a taurus a tower yeah Somebody withdrew from you and went to create some sort of other situation here. They left you out in the cold. They traded this in for something else. This is a person who was giving to another situation and this could have shocked you. I feel like this, this halted any sort of growth or forward movement that you and another person had. Tell me about this page of pentacles here. The six of cups could be a scorpio here two of pentacles somebody was was still going back and forth with somebody from their past they may not have let go of a past person whether they told you or not the temperance for some of you they were healing something with a sagittarius here in the past tell me about this queen of wands Eight of Pentacles, yeah, they were working on something with someone else, possibly a fire sign. This could have been a person who was saying, I'm at work, I'm working late, but the work was the Queen of Wands, if you get my drift. I'm at work, I'm working late, oh, I can't do that. You know that plan that we said that we would do? The lovers, somebody had a choice in love, okay, there's a choice in love here. Could be a Gemini, that plan that we said we was going to do, we was, we we're going to do a, a cinema day or a a lunchtime whatever or i'll take you out or whatever and then cancel at the last minute because i'm working late or you know i can't do xyz because i'm at work or i'm at the gym or something there was an excuse you could have found that there was the same excuse over and over again but what it was work was the queen of wands that's what they were working on but they didn't tell you that in the past somebody who was lying to you the six of wands this was somebody who was getting attention from another person. Two of Cups. They were getting attention elsewhere. They had a whole union on you. Tell me about this page of wands. This communication. Seven of Swords. They may want to confess something to you. They may want to come clean. About their immature antics. Or their flirtatious ways. The fact that they were out there exploring the Knight of Wands, they were out there exploring. This person was in and out with you, very fickle energy with you. They were giving you inconsistency while they were giving somebody else consistency. 
what is this communication this is seven of swords page of wands tell me about the seven of swords the lovers they want to come clean about having another person I don't know what the what the motivation behind this. Why do you need to know this? The strength card could be a Leo. Why would you need to know this? Why is this person coming in? What's the reason? We'll we'll work out their intentions in a minute, but I'm curious to know like what what's the reason here? Tell me more about that lover's energy. What are they confessing? That's what we'll ask first. Two of swords in the reverse. What are they confessing? What are they confessing? Ace of Swords. They're definitely confessing something. Wow. Five of Swords. The Ace of Swords. You know what I'm getting, Capricorn? You know what I'm getting? This person could have been Emperor. This could have been a person who wanted to maintain a certain level of control about a situation. This person could have went around to other people talking talking something. Whether this was a truth or not a truth, I do feel like this person with the Seven of Swords, they aren't a completely honest person. And I feel like where they could have disconnected from you, they went in another direction, they had another option, they started up a consistent union with somebody else, they were putting in work elsewhere, getting attention elsewhere, giving somebody else attention, this person. You know, they could have told people around them that you sabotaged a connection. This is a person who projects. This is a person who would go around to other people. Other people could have asked, well, what happened to so-and-so? What happened to Capricorn? You know, what what's going on there? And they could have very much been in the energy of saying to these people that uh, they've got another person. Or it's like they were, they were projecting. This is a person who, who kind of made themselves look like the victim when they knew that they sabotaged the connection. This could be coming out. People could be realising this about this person or something's being exposed about this person. Maybe why they're coming clean. The Two of Cups, yeah. Seven of Pentacles. This is somebody who's kind of waiting for the crap to hit the fan because they know what they did. They know what they've said. They could have made you out to be the person who did wrong in the relationship or put all the blame on you or spoke about you having had another person or you cheating or you stepping out. But in fact, what this person was doing was kind of trying to make themselves look more favorable in a situation, knowing that they were breadcrumbing you giving you breadcrumbs, peanuts, whatever it was, not a lot at all. And with the Page of Pentacles, not a lot at all, not a lot of energy. They were very stingy with you in, in every sense of the word. And they always had an excuse. You know, it's the person who always had an excuse. They were putting in work to someone else. Someone else was getting their attention and their, their consistency. Someone else was getting their energy. Someone else was getting the stability from them and it wasn't you Capricorn and this is a person who made it look like other people to other people that it was you that that stepped out or you that was inconsistent with them they want to confess this to you death card Page of Swords in the reverse. This person caused a lot of, of, of chaos in your life. I just feel like, you know, there could have been rumours. This person could have dragged you through some sort of scandal here. Unnecessary. Really unnecessary. People were talking about this. People were all up in the business. You could be very much an introvert and this person dragged you into some sort of mess. Tell me their intentions. Tell me their intentions. What is their intentions towards Capricorn, please? Tell me their intentions. The Knight of Wands, they haven't changed. Different deck, same energy. The 
What's the point? That's my first question. Knight of Wands, this is a person who's going to still be in and out. If they were in and out with you before, this person is going to continue to be in and out. They haven't changed. The star, they're going to give you false hope. Could be an Aquarius here or a fire sign. This is a person who's going to come in and give you false hope. If they tried to give you hope in the past to keep you strong along, this person could have led you on in some sort of way, knowing fully that they weren't able to commit to this or to commit to you or they still had another situation going on this is someone who is going to give you false hope again they haven't changed and i'll tell you this if they were cheating on you how you get them is how you lose them so if this person you know went off chose another person the queen of wands was the work that they were putting in they were giving their energy their time you know, putting in energy to this person, they could have regarded them as more favourable, more attractive, they could have seen this person as more attractive than you, in whatever sense of the word, they were very desirable, you know, they were very much passionate about this person that they went towards. If this person done that and went towards this person, how you get them is how you lose them. And they're doing the exact same thing to the person that they're with now, that they left you for as what they did to you they haven't changed this is a character trait of this person Capricorn the four of wands they're still committed they still have another situation this is a person who likes to be in and out this is a, pers a person who likes to maintain some sort of root stability with a person they like the comfortability you know they like to have the stability but they also like to play the field it's it's a character trait i'm seeing it's a character trait ten of cups this is a person who possibly has a whole family they could have children you could have had children with this person and they've jumped off into some sort of side piece situation a third party and they go back and forth this is a person who likes to have ping pong balls they like to bat back and forth Five of Swords and the world. And to the outside, they will say and do anything for people looking in to be seen as the person who's doing right. But they're 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 um they're conceited. There's they're a liar. As long as they look favourable, as they as long as they are sitting in an energy of I'm doing right, it's not my fault. This is a person who doesn't take accountability. It's not my fault, it's Capricorn's fault that this didn't work. High Priestess, but they keep this hidden. Okay, the real truth of it, they don't reveal. They like to keep this facade of being the, the good doer, the, the, the one who is not in the wrong. There's something about how people view them that takes precedence over truth. The Ten of Cups is still there. What is their intentions? They're still on some BS. Because the question is, what is their intention? Why are they coming in? They're still going to be painting some sort of false, false, false narrative or facade. This person's still committed elsewhere. They're still playing the field while being committed elsewhere. And with the Five of Swords, they're not coming in with anything good. They could be coming in to sabotage your forward movement, if anything. I feel like something, you, you've you completed this. This is over. This is over with the World Card. And the Five of Swords, they're trying to reopen the wound again. You know, the wound has healed somewhat. And it's like this person's finding a way to interrupt the wound all over again. Because they hurt you king of cups they hurt your feelings yeah they traded this in they traded love in for the queen of wands you gave a lot of time to this person and patience and what they did was they traded that in meanwhile telling other people that you traded them in they gave somebody else or other people i'm really getting a sense there was other people here that were gossiping about the situation but that gossip was spurred on by pe them telling people a different version of events, a different version of the story. 
Queen of Swords and the Four of Pentacles. This is the advice. I feel like you need to stay in your stance of being very logical and setting boundaries with somebody here. By all means, hear them out, but listen more than you speak. Because this is the type of person who tells on, them, on themselves. This is the type of person they work brain. They think they're very smart. Five of Swords is here twice. They think they're very smart. Six of Wands. It's all about how they're seen, how they're viewed. You know, as, as long as they're getting the positive attention, it's okay. They will crap over other people, crap on other people, just to make themselves look okay because they've messed up, they've effed up. They're in the wrong. So the only way to rectify that is to act to other people, outsiders who may be curious over what happened in a situation. You could have been in a whole committed situation, proper official out there, people could have known about the relationship and everything. And in, you know, people could have been curious to know well, what happened back there, you know. But to outside people, they had to say something, didn't they? And the first thing that they drew for is, I'm going to sneeze, confirmation, Capricorn. <coughs> Bless me. Capricorn sabotaged this. Capricorn stepped out. Capricorn was exploring other options. Capricorn was working late, telling me they were working late, but of course they weren't working late. They were doing someone else. No, 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 it was them. This is a person who projects. Hear them out, but lis listen more than you talk, because they will tell on themselves. And I feel like with the tower, yeah, this is someone who's coming in to cause disruption. They're not bringing anything good with that five of swords. One more. Two more, Ace of Swords and the Ace of Pentacles. You have something new coming. You have something different. You have a new opportunity that's not this. They will try to come in with some sort of communication here because I do feel like this person is telling on themselves to other people and cracks are starting to show. Cracks are starting to show with that death card. Could be a Scorpio you're dealing with. This is someone who there's cracks starting to show in their inconsistency, in their stories. This could be a person who makes up stories. They take the truth, but they remix it with lies as well. This could be a person that has lied so much and told so many untruths and remixed the truth so much to the point where in their mind, do they even know what the truth is anymore? The devil. king of cups you still have feelings for this person that's the thing and that might be why you were stuck on this person you could still be stuck on what they did to you as well but this is a game player this is a very calculated person when this person returns they're not bringing anything new so whatever you know them to be is exactly what they're bringing in they might just wrap it in a different wrapping package it different to make it seem like on the face of it that something's changed but the only reason why they're coming forward is because there's some sort of exposure and they're they're telling on themselves and they will tell on themselves when they come in with this communication so with the queen of swords and the four of pentacles close your mouth listen more than you talk by all means if this is an apology are they coming in to apologize what's the purpose of this what's the purpose of them coming in if they're coming in to apologise, by all means accept that apology, but keep it moving. Keep your mouth closed, don't tell this person too much of what, of what you've got going on, because this is the type of individual who will twist your words, twist it so much that they believe the lie that they've twisted and remixed. What's the purpose? Ace of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. This is somebody who wishes to get back to how it used to be they do want another opportunity to revive this they do but on what level are they reviving this this person's in a in a situation i'm seeing they've got another person here six of pentacles they're still juggling 
five of cups they will disappoint you again just like they did in the past six of cups five of cups and the six of pentacles this is a person that you're not going to be able to get the full attention the full consistency that you need in order to make something stable this person does this so don't think for one second that they're in a union and the union that they're in that they're being committed and consistent there this is an inconsistent individual so the same thing they've done to you the same behaviors that they've shown to you is absolutely the same behaviors that they're bringing into their situation that they have how you treat them or how you get them is how you lose them that's the message i'm hearing capricorn that's who, who's coming towards you you do have something new tell me what this new thing is tell me what this new thing is six of wands eight of swords tell me what you don't see is you're going to be overcoming that stuck energy you see that energy of you being stuck you not really seeing the 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 trees what's the saying seeing the clouds amongst the trees something like that you not seeing the bigger picture in something you're, you're gonna overcome that stuck feeling hanged man nine of pentacles page of wands seven of wands yeah hierophant in the reverse you're realizing that somebody just isn't aligned for you and you're choosing you a lot of you are going to be choosing to go it alone and just be very successful some of you could be getting a new job here but there's something about you not engaging in whatever this person is coming with because whatever it is it, it they're not coming with anything that's that's of substance or anything that you can really work with the hierophant is in the reverse there's a lack of, of, of ascension in this person. There's a lack of awareness, a lack of, of um, morals. This person lacks morals. The Hierophant is in the reverse. Their, their moral compass is warped. Nine of Swords in the reverse. I do see you getting over it. If you've got any anxiety around this person, when they arrive, don't overthink it. Just listen more than you talk. This person will tell on themselves. Capricorn, that's what I have for you. If you like how I read, please like, share and subscribe to the channel. And until next time, Cap, I will see you soon. You take care. Thank you for watching. Bye.